Hey, so today I wanted to go over and show you how we have set up the bunk beds for the kids. So Riley is four and Chloe is 10 months old. So I'll show you both beds and how we have managed to make them. So with the bedding, I have made a separate video on exactly what sheets we use for the bunks because we had to get them made up, but that's a separate video. So go check that out. So with Riley's bed, obviously he's got his <laughs> his comforters and his some of his comfy toys up there that he likes to have and we've got his name up there as well and some photos so we got this little box from Kmart really really handy it's just got some of his little knickknacks some toys that he uses and he quite often sits up here and just has a bit of quiet time has a bit of a play so that's cool so that's just as I said from Kmart and it just pushes on the end we've also got a 12 volt fan so we've got these for both of the kids so chloe has one as well um, and they just pop up there and you can move them around you can pop them up here wherever you like so they're really handy and obviously we got the pockets on both ends so he has books photos whatever he wants to pop in there so that's cool um go down to chloe's bed so it's a bit hard with Chloe at the moment. We can't put a lot in her bed because she is at the stage where she's crawling. Um, so I will make a separate video for you all on the mesh bed rail that we got made up and how that works. Um, and the bedding as well, again, is in that other video. So not much in Chloe's bed. Obviously she has the two pockets at the end um, with some reading books, but that's about it really for her because we can't have too much in her bed because she'll pull it all apart.